Hello, this is Senator Melissa Franzen with the weekly update. We are getting ready to meet the first deadline for the legislative process where policy bills um, have to make it through uh, this Friday. And then we have one more week to make it through both bodies, the Senate and the House. So bills are moving quickly. Uh, committee hearings are very um, busy indeed and going through long hours at night already. Uh, one of the main bills that, I'll, that I'm pushing this year is the prior authorization bill that we talked about earlier, and that bill made it through the Commerce Committee, which is a really tough um, uh, committee to go through, so we're excited that the bill made it through, and it's now going to state and local policy uh, to meet the Friday deadline, and then it will continue on through the process, and the House is a little slower, so please uh, make sure you make uh, uh, your calls to your legislators there and other people that you know to make sure you support the bill. It's a great bill to support um, patients who are struggling to get their medications on time because of the prior authorization process is um, really outdated, and we need to meet um, uh, updated to meet the demands of today to get patients um, the medications they need um, when they need it. The other items that happened this week was the governor uh, in, introduced his supplemental budget bill, and a lot of the efforts there in his bill are focused on early childhood education, which is great. Um, his bill focuses some more on the preschool, um, all-day preschool uh, budget supplemental uh, funding. Uh, I certainly support the scholarship funding more and more targeted for families that need it at this point, but we'll see how this all um, lands um, as we get closer to the end of session. The other parts um, of the week, uh, we are moving ahead with uh, the deadlines like I mentioned and a lot of work going on. Uh, so please continue to comment on, on the bills that you see through my newsletter. I'll give more details about the supplemental budget and the things going on in the Senate. And I look forward to hearing from you um, this week and as we get closer to the end of session. Thank you.